Those are chick glasses. They look good. Yeah, so the problem with me recording every day is I do the same thing every day. It's like, what are we doing today? Oh, the same thing we did yesterday. Cool. Stop doing the same thing. Well, I can't. Like, guess where we are right now? The gym. Here's that. <laughs> okay, everybody, what is going on? Welcome to a new video today. I have been super busy with getting the next SSD track finished, as well as I haven't even written a script for it yet, so I need to do that as well, and I'm working the next like four days in a row, so it's gonna be a little bit rough for me to get everything done. So today I figured I'll just make a normal beat video. Uh, I've got a really good idea. I feel like my, I had like a revelation. When I first started producing, I thought you needed the highest, like a very high BPM in order to make a really good song, and then every, everything that I tried to create a lower BPM was just awful. Because in my brain I thought, oh, a higher BPM, let's add more drums to make it more intense, and then lower BPM is for a uh, soft song, and then it's minimal, minimal drums. But I'm starting to realize that, you know, with focusing more on boom bap recently and a lot of like Jay Dilla drums, at that lower BPM, you actually have more room to add more drums than you would in a higher BPM song. In a higher BPM song, if you have a lot of drums, it's just gonna sound like a cluttered mess, which is basically what I've been doing for the past six months. So I actually really wanna try and make a really good like trap hard song at a lower BPM. So I think today we're gonna go and try that out. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so right now we're sitting at an 80 BPM, and actually already hit, and I already have this uh, these keys loaded up into Serum already preloaded. See what we're gonna do. I'm actually just gonna Control B that, and that's gonna be our basis. All right, and then I already have something in my head. Just every other one, we're gonna make that a chord. Pitch that one up. I think I actually want to go in like descending, and finally here just a, just a. My may 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 major chord. <laughs> I cannot get that correct. There we go. Let's try that again. All right, and I'm pretty sure I don't really know the C minor scale, but I'm pretty sure that C sharp is not in the scale. But I'm okay with that. It can be out of key so long as it's like one semitone above the key, the key that follows it. I'm pretty sure it is. And just using my ear, this already sounds pretty good. Like I'm okay with that. And then for this one, I want it to be able to. I want to keep that tension going with another sharp. And maybe we'll just go like a, a few semitones higher for the next one. No, lower. I'm just gonna go two down then. Perfect. What else could we do? What else could we do? All right, we might need to go find some, a different sound because I actually don't like this one anymore. I feel like this would be cool, but it's not. Yep, it's not cool. The search continues. That's the one. Okay, that sounds better. I think that's gonna be it. Let's go add some drums, which I was really excited to go do. I've been really loving drums recently. Like I've been doing so, that was my ankle. I've been doing so much work on drums, it's actually really helping me out. 808s, old, should I? I don't know actually. We're gonna use that one instead. Or Liable's cousin. I have been doing a lot of boom bap recently, so if these drums sound a little bit boom bap-ish, then that's why. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh? -huh. uh? No, it wasn't right. No, uh, no, it's not. I was way wrong. There we go. Alright, cool. That's done with. Okay, and then we're gonna lower that down to about there. And then for every third one, I did this in a recent track too. Uh, I want to get every one in the middle. Okay. Yeah, it's just a little boom back fish, but that's fine. Really glad my loop points are on. That makes me sound, that makes me look really professional.
Cool. Dig that. Dig that a lot. Phone, you're gonna get cut. Actually, usually that's what I'll do. I'll just go ahead and get these, the 808s in the right pattern that I want, and then I'll go ahead and change the, the notes of them right after. Cool. I think that's the, the loop so far. All right, everybody, that is a wrap. Thank you so very much for watching. I'm gonna go ahead and rearrange this all right now. But here is the intro, and it's gonna lead to the black screen where it shows my, where to follow me and everything like that. So if you haven't followed me on SoundCloud, go ahead and give that a, a chance. Go and, wow, that's kind of pathetic. Go ahead and head over there, I'd really appreciate it. Welcome to the simulation.